All right. Now, listen, there's been a lot of speculation about Godzilla versus Kong. There's me their Mecha Godzilla is going to appear. And Godzilla is not Godzilla. It is Godzilla. 100% Godzilla. Pure Godzilla. Why? Because Godzilla can lose weight and has shown to lose weight on several occasions if he doesn't feed off of nuclear energy. Also, he he needs to eat nuclear waste in order to grow. Plus, Mecha Godzilla will not appear in the movie. Why I say that? Because that could be the Gotengo. A upgraded version from Godzilla Final Wars, even though it shares no continuity with other films. And it's going to make his first appearance in Godzilla vs. Kong. And Kong is pulling a Kratos and actually using a enchanted axe made from Godzilla's dorsal plates. Or Dagon's dorsal plates. What I'm saying is. Kong might actually win. And Godzilla might lose. This might be the end. Of the Godzillas. But I guarantee you. That that is 100% in the flesh, Godzilla. He has returned to his normal self. The Godzilla you saw that was peaceful, that wasn't the real deal. It was Godzilla, but that wasn't him showing his, his emotions. He wasn't vengeful like the other Godzillas were. were. So I guarantee you that Godzilla is Godzilla. Arteri or Arter theory is incorrect. Now, the movie's been pushed back to March, I think. And I think they're going to push it back again and again. The more we keep speculating about it. Because in my mind, I'm thinking that the more we sp speculate about it, there's no point in us for to watch it because we're just going to spoil the whole movie. Like Arturi said, she's still a newbie. She needs to understand one thing. That Godzilla height and weight varies. Depending on how much nuclear waste he has consumed. 